Ethiopia is a country that captivates. It is unique for its astonishing rock formations, spectacular landscapes, a rich and distinct culture, and of course, very beautiful women. Stay with me as we explore this captivating country. Number 1. Ethiopia is home to some of the world's most beautiful women. Ethiopian women are renowned for their distinctive facial features marked by high cheekbones, almond-shaped eyes, and smooth glowing skin. Beyond physical attributes, their beauty emanates from their rich cultural heritage expressed through traditional attire and vibrant adornment. Ethiopian women are very industrious and hardworking. Number 2. Historically, Ethiopia is considered the first place on Earth where a first ancestor stepped foot. Scientists found ancient bones there. They found one called Lucy in Ethiopian's Afro region, a 3.2 million year old fossil. She is one of the oldest and most complete human skeletons ever found. Some people call Ethiopia the cradle of humanity because it's like the old old home where our first human family started. It's a bit like finding a really really old family photo album, but instead of pictures, it's a land full of stories, etched in time. Don't go anywhere because we are just getting started. Number 3. Ethiopia has its own calendar. While most of the world follows the regular calendar, Ethiopia has its own unique version. They have 13 months instead of 12. The first 12 months lasts 30 days and the 13th month lasts either 5 or 6 days. It's like having an extra month to party or chill. <laughs> and get this, the year is a bit behind ours, about 7 to 8 years. So, when you're in Ethiopia, it's like a time-traveling adventure where you're a bit in the past, but in the coolest way possible. <laughs> time is a funny thing, isn't it? Number 4. Ethiopia is widely regarded as the birthplace of coffee. Legend has it that a 9th century goat heather named Kaudi noticed this goat was becoming unusually energetic after munching on red berries from a certain plant. Curious about this newfound vitality, Kaldi sampled the berries himself and experienced a similar burst of energy. Intrigued by the effects, he shared his discovery with local monks, leading to the creation of a drink that helped them stay awake during long hours of prayer. This serendipitous encounter with coffee beans eventually evolved into the rich coffee culture Ethiopia is renowned for today. Number 5. Ethiopia is one of the few African countries that was never formally colonized by European powers. As a result, it has preserved its culture and traditions over the years. It did experience Italian occupation from 1936 to 1941, but it was never fully colonized. There are several reasons why Ethiopia was never colonized. The country's geography makes it difficult to invade. It is characterized by high mountains, rugged terrain, extremely arid deserts, and high temperatures. On the other hand, during the scramble for Africa, Ethiopia was led by Emperor Menelik II. He is said to have been a strong leader who managed to unify various regions of the country and strengthen the army to triumph in key battles against Italy. Also, even though Ethiopia is a country with immense ethnic and cultural diversity, a shared national identity and social cohesion played a role in its resistance to colonialism. Number 6. Ethiopia has its own special way of writing called Gaze or Ethiopic. Imagine English has its own super code just for Ethiopia. <laughs> this writing system is unlike what other nearby countries use. 
has been around for a really long time, over 2,000 years. So, while the rest of the world might be using one set of letters, Ethiopia has talked to its own unique style. It's like having a secret language that's been passed down through generations, making Ethiopia's way of writing something truly special and different from the others around it. Ethiopia is definitely a unique and fascinating country. But wait, there's more. Number 7. Ethiopia is located in the northeastern part of Africa, commonly known as the Horn of Africa. It is strategically proximate to the Middle East and Europe and has easy access to the major parts of the region, which enhances its international trade. The country is roughly as large as France and Spain combined and is five times the size of the UK. Number 8. The Ethiopian political system is a federal democratic republic with territorial organization divided into regional states and cities. Addis Ababa is the Ethiopian capital. Due to the country's ethnic diversity, these states were chosen based on ethnic criteria, that is, the largest ethnic groups have their own region and state. Some of these state regions are the Somali Regional State, the Afo Region, the Oromo Region, the Amara Region, and the Tigray Region. Number 9. The Ethiopian Highlands, often dubbed the Roof of Africa, are a breathtaking expanse of elevated terrain characterized by rugged mountains, deep valleys, and expansive plateaus. This geographical marvel reaching elevations of over 4,000 meters contributes to Ethiopia's diverse and unique landscape. The highlands are not only a haven for stunning natural scenery, but also host numerous endemic species of flora and fauna. The Ethiopian highlands are not only a visual spectacle, but also a testament to the country's rich biodiversity and natural heritage. Number 10. Ethiopia is incredibly diverse, with over 80 different ethnic groups and around 90 languages spoken. Ethiopia is one of the first countries to officially adopt Christianity as the state religion in the 4th century. The country also has a significant Muslim population. Thanks for joining me on this fascinating journey through the rich tapestry of Ethiopia. From its ancient roots as the cradle of humanity to the breathtaking landscapes of the Simian Mountains, Ethiopia is a country that captivates with its history, diversity, and natural wonders. I hope this glimpse sparks your curiosity and inspires you to explore the wonders of Ethiopia for yourself. Don't forget to hit that like button, subscribe for more explorations, and let me know in the comments which Ethiopian facts surprised you the most. Until next time, stay curious and keep exploring.